asked you to post a photo and tell me about it on social. Well, I went to my very first Portland Pickles game at Walker Stadium on Friday night. It was so much fun and I highly recommend getting the fried pickles if you go. Then on Saturday night, I went to the Starlight Parade and there were so many cool floats and displays like this one from Schilling Lights on Lark. And they know all about lighting up the night. They put on a spectacular holiday light show in Milwaukee every year. So it's pretty cool they got to show off their lighting talents in the Rose Festival Parade this weekend. Pretty cool. Well, these two got to have their own ATV parade this weekend. Ashley shared this awesome photo of her littles four wheeling in the Oregon dunes. I'm jealous. They look so cool, don't they? Ronaldo's little dude got to experience the magic of the ice cream truck for the very first time. And if you look closely, ooh, it's a good choice too. Looks like a Reese's ice cream treat. Yum. Teresa's little one, well, he's all grown up. She got to see her son graduate from Jesuit High School this weekend. Big congratulations to you both. And it was a great weekend to get out there with your bestie. Heather took her best friend to Lincoln City for a little getaway before she gets married in just a few weeks. Congratulations. Tammy was chasing waterfalls at McDowell Creek in Lynn County. That's Terrace Waterfall behind her. Really pretty. And check out this view from Mother Nature. Wow, Debbie had a little visitor in her backyard this weekend. A fawn, just a day or so old, she says. Still very wobbly. And speaking of animals, Corey spent Sunday volunteering at Oregon Dog Rescue. This little cutie is Pepper, and she'll be ready for adoption soon. Just throwing that out there to anyone who might need a new furry friend. You can share your weekend photos of any of the good stuff happening in your community. Text us at that number on your screen, 503-226-5088, or you can email us at thegoodstuff at kgw.com.